Hi there, my name is Alastair Kennedy and I'm the Sociable Social Worker and I give practical advice to social workers, newly qualified social workers and those looking to foster an adult. And in today's video, we're actually going to look at things they don't teach you in university that you'll find out when you start your new social work job. So, let's get to it. The drugs do work. No, 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 I don't mean those kind of drugs. What I mean is you'll find that every social worker has lots of potions, lotions, and when you start out, people will have vitamins for all things. Indeed, I had a Barocca addiction when I was in child protection. And you'll find people take out, oh, I've got a tablet for that, I've got a tablet for that. It doesn't matter that I had a Barocca addiction because I smoked about 40 fags a day, drank about 25 pints of lager a week and hardly got any sleep. But, you know, whatever gets you through those team meetings or whatever gets you through that next professionals meeting. Top tip number two, you might not be liked as a social worker and a lot of tutors don't tell you this. What they say is, because we're in this kind of era of social media where everybody puts stuff on Instagram and, and we can take off people from our Instagram or our Facebook page that d disagree with us, that actually what we don't end up doing is seeing you know, getting into disagreements, we don't have, we can't have debate, proper debate as professionals and COVID has made that even worse. So what I'm saying to you is it's not easy in social work and a lot of newly qualified social workers will say to me, Alastair, I went to this family and they just didn't take to me. And what I always say to them is, you know, some clients will never engage. Don't worry, you've got enough pals. Just tread your own course, do what you need to do. As long as you're secure in your practice, you know, you'll be fine, you'll be absolutely fine. Stay focused and always stay friendly. Top tip number three, Sherpa Tenzing. You know that new car that you just leased or you took out in a PCP because you actually got your first wage as a social worker? Well, I can guarantee with you, it's gonna be a bomb site within weeks of you qualifying. It'll be full of detritus from health bar wrappers, from stuff that clients have left, from uh, full of baby toys if you work in child protection and you know and you've and from stuff that where you've had to drive a client to an appointment what i would say to you is keep the nice car for the weekends and buy a banger for your social work top tip number four you might have found when you were in a placement that you lost your voice in terms of meetings and that affected your confidence and i actually have a video on confidence in meetings you should go and watch that but if you have lost your voice or you felt that you know you've been overtaken by other people in, uh, whose views trump yours even if they're wrong then obviously you need to have a view particularly if you start out in social work you need to have a view obviously just don't open your mouth and let your belly rumble but back it up with evidence if it's your caseload own it they're your clients you need to find your own path through those meetings so there you go, the things they don't teach you at university about social work jobs. I hope that was helpful. Drop it a like if it was and subscribe to the channel would be great. Thanks and I'll see you again.